Hi, I'm Paula and I work for GlaxoSmithKline at the Montrose site and I'm a physical properties chemist. GlaxoSmithKline manufactures lots of different products. We make medicines that are used for asthma, malaria, HIV. My role is as a physical properties chemist. So when we are making the medicines, then I look at the, the actual physical properties. What that means is the particle size. In particular, if you're looking at drugs that are used in inhalers, the particle size is very important. It affects how well the drug actually um, works once it's inside your body. We use microscopy as well to see the different crystal forms of the drugs. We can check that we're making the, the right thing. My typical day is split between working in the office and working in the lab. Um, to begin with, when I joined the company, there was a lot of training involved in lots of different techniques, and we will use them day in, day out, routinely to check the products that we make. My supervisor will give a list of priorities to our group. We will work together to decide who will take responsibility for which part of the project, how it's going to come together in the end, what information we need from each other. Um, so we'd work together in a team. You can be in the lab or in the office through the day. It's very varied. You've got a lot of control over your own day-to-day -day activities. And then we would come back together um, to report back our results. In GlaxoSmithKline, there is a huge scope for travel within the business. You can travel to different sites within the UK for training and different techniques. Um, I know people who are on the graduate training programme and they will move around each year to a different site to see different aspects of the company. My working hours are from half past eight till five. Our site is 24 hours, so there are other chemists who will work shifts. It very much depends on your role within the company. When I started working at GlaxoSmithKline, we get 26 days holiday each year, plus all the public holidays. And we also, in some sites, get a Christmas shutdown. It's not an extra benefit, and it's not every year, but it does happen. It will. Well, I appreciated it because I got two weeks off at Christmas. So. <laughs> there is a health and dental scheme that you can opt into if that's what you want to do that would cover yourself, your partner, your family. You can buy shares in the company so I think that was a, a nice touch when you came here because I, I asked a lot of people, does anyone do this? And everyone went, oh absolutely, this is, this is a great thing to, to do and they really believe in what they're doing if they're actually buying shares in the company that they work for. I never knew what kind of job I wanted to do and I picked as wide a variety of subjects as I could at school. Um, and I knew that I enjoyed science, so I did chemistry and physics. Uh, the course was called chemical physics, because I couldn't pick between either one. And I had an absolutely fantastic physics teacher who would explain things from the textbook, would put the textbook down and go, well, in English, what that means is. And he was, he was absolutely brilliant. And same thing with my chemistry teacher. In fifth year at school, I did the Scottish hires. Um, we did five different hires, English, maths, chemistry, physics, and biology. Um, sixth year you got to carry some of them on uh, for the English and Chemistry and Maths carried on. So I went to university and I did a master's course in Chemistry and Physics. After that I did a PhD course which makes me a Doctor of Chemistry and when I was looking for jobs after that there was various different companies we went for interviews and the pay scale generally was in the region about 20 to 26 thousand pounds. You have to be fairly organised, you need good communication skills, team working, you need to understand your own stuff. My ambition was to actually get out of university and get a job in the real world. I want to learn as much as I can about how it actually works, how what I do impacts in the real world. I do like the science, I like the people that I work with, I like the area that I'm in. Um, but I like being able to control my own day. Science is a great thing to be involved with. Um, there's so many different areas, you can travel the world with it and do anything you like. You can pick what interests you and, and just follow that route. And science is fun. <laughs>